Hello friends. Today we discuss another metric. So over here, in this case, we have to find out counting number of zeros. Counting number of zeros. So for example, if we have a factorial. 10 factorial and we have to find out the number of zeros in this case so how we can calculate so the logic is you have to find out the number of 5 multiple of 5 okay count number of 5s in the given function so let's say over here if we solve this 10 factorial so I got 10 into 9 into 8 into 7 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. Okay. So over here the number of 5s are over here and over here. So I got 2 5s. Okay. So number of zeros are 2 in this case. Okay. So let's have a general formula. So the formula is n over let counting number of zeros at the end of n factorial. We have n factorial for n factorial. The counting number of zeros we can calculate using the given formula n over 5 plus n over 5 square plus n over 5 cube plus so on okay using this formula we can calculate number of zeros in the given factorial okay so let's take the example of the given function that is 10 factorial if you have to find out the number of zeros in 10 factorial so put 10 divided by 5 plus 10 divided by 5 square so over here 10 divided by 25 we can ignore this so 5 divided by 10 it is equal to 2 as we already calculated let's take another example if we have to find out the number of zeros in 100 factorial so we can calculate using 10 100 divided by 5 plus 100 divided by 5 square that is 25 plus 100 divided by 5 cube that is 125 so we can ignore this so we can calculate this only so 10 divided by uh, 100 divided by 5 it is 20 plus it is 25 25 divided, 100 divided by 25 it is 4 so total number of 24 zeros are present in this case okay let's take one more example if you have to find out number of zeros in 126 factorial okay so again you have to apply the formula 126 divided by 5 plus 126 divided by 25 as it is 5 square plus 126 divided by 125 plus 126 divided by 5 over here square cube 5 raised to 4 so we can ignore this so we have to add these values only so over here 5 when you divide 126 divided by 5 5 2 25 over here plus when you divide 25 126 divided by 25 you got 5 plus over here only 1 so number of zeros are 31 in this case when you have 126 factorial so this is how you can find out number of zeros 
in a given factorial function. Thank you.